Yes, but the fact that HBO is opening a wall mm -hmm. that has been closed for a very long time, right? This is, they have not done this. Yeah, and I remember Plepler at our BuzzFeed Bruce thing when, when Peter Laurie interviewed him, and he said, when are you going to go over the top? And he said, it's just math. And the math right now doesn't make sense for them to lose the cable fees to go over the top. But the day will come. It is absolutely inevitable that HBO is going to be sold on a standalone service. I, I'm speculating, but I can't imagine it not happening. And for Amazon, we've debated at length what would justify this higher price price for Prime. Now that we have seen some of these newer features come in, yep. if you're a Prime customer, you don't pay any more for this HBO content. Does this contribute to that? I know, and I was actually like going through the press release really trying to find that. It does seem the three-year-out content you just get as part of Prime. Look at Netflix, raising it a dollar or two over the next year because they're going to buy more content. This is a classic case of adding more to the bundle, right, and raising the price ever so slightly. These guys are like business school economics professors with how they're playing this game between sharing costs and then, and then pairing up when it makes sense. Right.